Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So this week's video is going to be my February favorites. I really want to talk about all the stuff that I've been loving all throughout the month of February. And some of it has to do with makeup and some of it doesn't, so I hope you don't mind. But if you guys are interested in seeing what I've really been loving in the month of February, then keep on watching. Okay, so let's start off with the stuff that has to do with makeup. Let's do that. One of the things that I've been loving is this liquid illuminator by NYX. This is in the color Sunbeam. Now, I'm pretty sure I've used this before on my channel, but I mean, I bought it such a long time ago. It is such a pretty pinky highlight color to put on. And what I love about it is that it's a liquid. For us people with dry skin, powders are not necessarily the way to go all the time, especially for me. I really love applying this with a damp beauty sponge. I just put some on the back of my hand and then I'll just dab the beauty sponge right into it and then I can just kind of like dab it onto my cheeks. It's what I'm wearing today. It's pretty intense and you can build it up a little bit. At first I kind of stopped using it because I felt it was glittery but I think I was just applying it wrong and the way that it applies with the beauty blender is so beautiful so I have been living for that this month. Another thing that I have really been loving is the new, well, it's new to me, the Carly Bible Palette. Oh, guys, if you guys don't own this, you have to get it. Um, I didn't purchase it when it came out because I have a, a palette that's a little similar to this in color. So I said, you know what, I'm probably not going to use it because I already use my other palette so much. But I was wrong. The colors in here are so beautiful. What I like is it's about half matte so there's like five matte colors five shimmer colors and then all down here are beautiful highlights and I use all of the matte colors and I use this color up here just to like throw on my lid one day and it's beautiful and I constantly mix together these two highlights at the bottom I put them both over the NYX liquid illuminator on my face today to kind of set it and it just sets it so beautifully and the best part about this is that it's only $14.95. I would go pick it up soon if you're interested because it is limited edition. It's been out for a while and I don't know when it's gonna go off the market for good. It is by BH Cosmetics so I'm pretty sure you can find it on their website. I picked mine up from Ulta. I don't know who else might carry it but um, go pick it up. Another thing that I have been trying out this month is a new neck and like degliche cream. This one is by Olay. I picked this up in my last haul video and this is Olay Regenerous Night Recovery Cream. And I just, guys, this is everything. <sighs> it smells like very fresh and like what a cream should smell like. I don't know how to describe the smell, but it just smells so nice and refreshing right before I go to sleep. And when I put this on my neck and my chest, it glides on and it makes my skin feel so silky. And I love that. So I just, I've really been loving this. I don't notice any breakouts from it or anything crazy like that. So this is a really good night cream so far. And I really like it. So I think pretty much everything else has nothing to do with makeup. So the first thing is this right here. I've really been loving these. This is the Breakfast Velveeta Cookies in the flavor Toasted Coconut. I wasn't sure if I was going to like these because I'm so used to the cinnamon brown sugar ones that I always eat with my coffee in the morning before work. And I love these. This kind of tastes like a thinner version of the Samoan Girl Scout cookies. And in my opinion anyway, but I really love these. Um, I hope they're a permanent flavor, but I'm not sure if they are or not. So um, give these a try if you haven't already because they're good. All right, so obviously you guys have seen me rave about this. This is almost finished. This is my bubble tea or bubble tea. Some people call it bubble tea. Um, I get my bubble tea at Menlo Park Mall in New Jersey. 
and I go to the store called I Love Bubble Tea and I love their menu there because I feel like they have such a good variety and when I go there the people are really helpful because it can be a little confusing as to how to order this if you don't know what you want or if you've never tried it before so if you're interested in trying it out the flavors that I have tried so far are strawberry taro with regular boba at the bottom and it tastes like the milk that you drink after you eat your cereal. That's the best way to describe it. And it just tastes so good. Um, this one today is a new one that I tried. This is the vanilla tea with regular boba at the bottom and a little bit of sugar. And it's really sweet already as it is. And I just, I love it guys, it's so good. All right, three more things. Where should I start? Okay, so the one thing that I have been living for lately is this thing oh, right here. This is my charger. I have an Apple phone, and everybody knows that the Apple phone comes with like a three foot cord, and it reaches from like where I plug it in, and I'm usually sitting on my bed, and I'm usually like this as I'm on my phone because it doesn't reach my bed and I know you guys have those issues too so I really wanted to get a longer cord this is a six foot cord and I got this from Walgreens for like 15 bucks um, and I wasn't quite sure if I was gonna like it or not because I keep hearing that if you don't get a cord that's from Apple that it usually craps out on you really quickly and I was afraid of that but this one is like not cheap at all it's very well made um i don't think let me see if i have the box so that um i can list the company that it's from so this is what the box looks like this is by the company infinitive and it says it's a lightning cable for use with apple products and it's a six foot cord it's also compatible with an ipod iphone or ipad so I guess it gives you more information in the back as far as what it's compatible with. But I have the iPhone 6S and it really um, does a great job of giving me the extra feet that I need. Because I, I don't know, I'm constantly on my phone you guys. Or I'm constantly on my iPad in the middle of the night when I wake up, before I go to sleep. And it's really nice to actually sit comfortably in my bed with a charger cable that reaches far enough. So I've really been loving that lately. Um, another thing to go off of that is my phone case. I get so many compliments on my phone case and um, when I saw it, I fell in love with it and I had to have it. This is from Claire's in the mall. I believe Icing also carries covers like this and it's just a very thick rubber case. Um, I really like it because I like a big phone case. It's very easy to hold. It's nice to hold it when I'm talking on the phone. Um, and I also like that if I drop it, my phone is so well protected in this. Of course, it doesn't have anything over the screen, but I've never had an issue with that. Um, I've dropped this phone so many times getting out of my car, in my house, at school, or wherever, at work, and I've never had an issue. My phone screen has never cracked, and I've actually had this for a couple months now and I don't know why it hasn't been in any of my recent like favorites videos but I get a lot of compliments on this phone case and I think it's so cute but some people can't decide is this a cupcake or ice cream I don't know I'm gonna go with ice cream because that's what I thought it was when I first bought it and this is the last thing that I have been in love with lately I have been how do I say this in the past I used to be a big sneakerhead. Um, and for those of you who don't know what that is, um, it's just a person that really loves sneakers and you have a lot of them. And so I used to buy a lot of sneakers back when I was in high school, but once I got to college and I was working out all the time and busy going to school, I just stayed in my workout sneakers or just like more business appropriate shoes now that I'm older and I'm working. So I actually went out and bought a pair of sneakers that I saw, I saw them online. Somebody was wearing them online and I thought they were so cute and they can go with literally any dress down outfit. So these are them. I love them so much. 
and they are extremely lightweight like extremely lightweight this is probably the lightest shoe that i own um so when you put it on it literally feels like you don't have anything on um and these are by nike so these are on the side of the box it says nike rouge one and i got mine in the youth size youth seven so if you are an eight or eight and a half try the youth seven size because I saved quite a bit of money. The tag price says $65, but again, I had a gift card for like 50 bucks to Macy's. So I went into Macy's and I bought them and I ended up only paying like 15 bucks. So if you're looking for, I don't know, like a gym shoe or just like a cool, comfortable, casual sneaker, definitely check these out because they are just, they're my babies. And that's it guys. That's everything that I have really been loving in the month of February. Let me know what you guys have been loving. I love it when you guys leave me comments, any comments. I've been getting more comments on my videos lately and what I love about them is that they're really inspiring. Like, I'm just, with everything that's been going on on the internet lately and how negative people can be, I'm just so surprised. And I hate to say that, but I am. I'm so surprised on how nice people are to me and how they say that they really love my videos and that I should just keep going, I'm doing great, and I just really appreciate that because I really like doing my videos and it's like a passion of mine. So thank you so much for sticking with me you guys and leave me your comments about what you've been loving because I love to hear about new things and try them and whoa, calm down. That's going to wrap up this video guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. I really need a pillow. Like, I need to be this much taller in my life, you know? Let me start over. Alright. As I chew on my boba balls. That didn't sound right. Oh, did you hear my voice went off? It's like crazy. Alright, thumbnail.